Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Monkey Putter with another course review from PGA Tour 2K21. Now the course I'm going to be playing today is called Flagstaff Centennial. I'm going to be playing off a black tee at 7,427 yards. Usual course conditions for first time playthroughs. And the default time of day and weather is noon and light cloud. So let's head off to that first tee and we'll get this round underway. Right, well we've got a monster par 4 to open the round with. Over 500 yards. Oh, that could be... No, it's okay. That's okay. Oh, that's a bad swing. Here, 20 feet, a little bit of right to left on this one. No, it's a bad read. Just a par to open the round. Gotta be careful that water hazard there to the left of the green. That's a tricky pin placement, kind of tucked behind that bunker there. Oh, another fast one. This is not going well. Now, these are very shallow bunkers, so I can, I can chip that. was close just another par narrow fairway at the third not an overly long par four but it will require a good tee shot to hit that fairway Yeah, that's in good shape. Gotta be careful here not to go too long. It all gathers into that bunker there. I'd like to try and get it close though. Yeah, not bad. Reindeer in the background there. Okay, quite a bit of left to right break on this one. That's a really nice putt. First birdie of the round. Oh, 
as you can see there's a lot of water scattered around on this course got to be extremely careful It's going to be short, I think. Yeah. I should have clubbed up, but I wasn't quite sure. I've left myself a long putt now for birdie. Ah, oh, that's a really nice putt. Back to back birdies. And um, we've got a par five now. 542. It's a good drive. Pin tucked behind that tree there. Try a little bit of draw on this. It's a big bounce. That's not bad at all. Opportunity for an eagle. Oh, well, hold. That's a great eagle. a long par four uh, sorry par three I should say uh, line looks quite good it just depends on the bounce needs to slow down just running away from the hole a bit but it's not a bad shot misread that one I think yeah it started moving to the right sooner than I expected Now then, this is a long par five, close to 600 yards, but it's a dog leg to the right, so it's going to be playing longer than that. Yeah, this is going to be a three-shotter. Okay, not to worry. What we'll do... I think I might club down here. Play ultra safe. Hit the hybrid. Quite a nice distance this, should be the perfect gap wedge. Ah, 
that's gone a little long. It's a shame. Just slightly misread that one. That's a shame. This one here is going to have to be a fade around those trees. be in trouble get lucky yeah that's okay clip the tree but it's okay It's a bad swing, I've hit it fast. Oh no, that is a ah, oh, that's a terrible, terrible putt. This is a tricky tee shot. Extremely narrow fairway. Water either side. That's a nice drive. Spin back. That's okay. Okay, into the back nine now. We start the the back nine with a par five at the tenth. This is a tricky tee shot, a uh, tee shot, second shot with those two trees in the way. Now I can either go left or right. Now I've got the wind coming off the left, which might help a little bit here as well. So I think I'm going to go for the fade. Needs to come round a bit more. Ah, oh, it's not going to come round enough. Oh no! It was the right idea, just not executed very well. Not too bad. Ah, this is a tricky little one. 
We don't want to run too far here because that goes downhill towards the water. Got the wind behind. And it's a slight dog leg to the right. Uh, to the left. Okay. I'm wondering if it might be sensible here to hit the th three wood and accept it's going to be a longer second. Three. Slightly downhill line. Let's try the, the seven iron. That's going to need a big bounce. break on this one that's a nice birdie I could do with a strong back nine to make up for the mistakes I made on the front nine This is a, a, a dinky par three. 108 yards. If you take into account the slight drop in elevation. Got that wind behind though. a fraction long good line that's a great putt That's a really pretty part of the course. Yeah, I like that. So it's going to be playing about 100 yards, but we've got that wind as well to take into account. Ah, oh, it's a bit short. Oh, what an idiot. Yeah, that's a mistake. That's a good positive putt. On to hole number 14. Par 4. Now this one's certainly drivable. Even a 3 wood, I could get quite close to it with that wind behind. Oh no! Terrible swing. What? 
a complete idiot. Oh, what a complete idiot. Yeah. Oh dear. Well, thankfully, this part is pretty straight. There might be a little bit of break towards the end. Well, I got my birdie, but the tee shot was terrible. Now then, we've got a par five coming up. Let's hope it's... Uh, I was just about to say, let's hope it's reachable in two, but alas, it's 644 yards, so this is definitely a three-shotter. Why couldn't I put a swing on it like that on the previous hole? Never mind. Another narrow fairway. It's not too bad, but will I be blocked out by that tree? No, I think I'll be okay. Nice birdie. Long par for 16, just under 500 yards. Be good. Come on, be good. That's a nice shot from back there. That's a good birdie because that's a long par four. This is a really tricky par three, 240 yards. Pin tucked on the right hand side, dangerously close to that bunker. Needs a lucky bounce here. It's safely on the green.
No, complete misread. That was a poor putt. Tricky hole though, that's a really tricky par 3 that one. So on to the final hole, par 4 to finish the round with. Dog leg here, I'm going to hit the driver and I'm going to hit a bit of a draw. Just a little bit, just to see if we can take it around that corner. Oh, I've hit it ever so slightly slow, that's going to be in the bunker. Oh, what a shame. I'm in trouble here. This is into the wind as well. Oh dear, that's gone quite a long way to the right. And it's safely on the green, outside chance of a birdie. Oh, no, it's too hard. Oh, what a shame. I think I had the line as well. Par to finish. Two pars to finish. Well, a good back nine up until 17. Well, that's a really nice course. I enjoy playing it. My only slight criticism is um, I would have liked to have seen the bunkers a bit deeper. They're really shallow. And if you do end up in a greenside bunker, you can play a chip shot rather than a splash shot, which yeah, is not ideal. But the course layout was great. It was good fun. Um, some tricky holes as well. Um, some narrow fairways to make you think. Uh, water houses everywhere as well, which you've got to be careful of. So well done to the course designer. Um, that was good fun. I enjoyed it. Well, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please hit that like button down below and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I would really appreciate it. So take care, everyone, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.